That's right, Brian. Big changes could be on the way here. On Monday, Charlotte City Council is expected to take a vote on whether to rezone this land. It would turn from office into commercial and mixed use space, and that would pave the way for hundreds of apartments to be built here, changing the landscape of Cotswold. Jerry Rhodes gets the best of both worlds. Been in this location for 28 years. His barber shop is in the center of Cotswold, but it's not buzzing with as much activity and traffic tie-ups. It's like Russian roulette trying to get past the Chick-fil-A line. Since it's one block back from busy Randolph Road. Yeah, I like the Cotswold. I wouldn't want to be in the shopping center next door. It's crowded as that is and people getting in and out. So. He likes being tucked away. It's just nice to have parking to be able to get people in and out and not have all the hustle and bustle. But the quaint community could get much busier if a developer gets this piece of land across Colwick Road rezoned to build 260 apartments. Neighbors against the rezoning started this website, Save Cotswold, in opposition. They say the proposed apartment building will be too tall, a little bit higher than the nearby Sonic Automotive Complex, which stands at around 80 feet, and they're worried about traffic. If this is a business area, it should stay a business area, not an apartment area, because it'll uproot a lot of things going on already, and it'll add to uh, congestion in the area. The land and vacant building where the apartments would be built is currently a buffer to a neighborhood on Chiswick Road. The customers in this neighborhood are pretty much against it. Jerry says he falls right in the middle. It is a bright spot that we may get more business out of it. He just wants to make sure his customers have a place to park and he has a place to keep doing business. Been here a long time but still plan to be here more years. So. Now, neighbors say they are also concerned because they say that the developer plans to take down around 60 trees here. And they also say they're worried because there is no street level retail in these plans that have been laid out. Now, there have already been some public hearings on this issue, but you still have a chance to speak up if this concerns you. And you can just email your Charlotte City Council members or give them a call before they're expected to take that vote on Monday. I'm live in Cotswold. Robin Kennedy, Queen City News. Yeah, a lot of small